Recently, I heard someone say that he does not use the Insert New Slide option in PowerPoint because when he does, then it by default it adds a title slide and he would just have to delete these things if he didn't need them. I'm Susan Joyce Schlieff and I'm known as the PowerPoint Queen and I'm going to show you an easier way to handle this. Of course, one way to do this would be to go to Insert, New Slide, and choose a blank slide or whatever you wanted to use from the menu, but that's a lot of clicks. And I know I prefer to use Control M myself, and by default that does add a title slide. This person said they prefer to use Duplicate Slide, but then you have to delete a bunch of things that you don't need on the next slide as well. So let me show you an easier way. We're going to go into the Slide Master by going to View, Slide Master, and what we want to do is find the blank slide and move it into the third position for this slide master. And it should take the place then of the title slide. There we go. One, two, three. Now we can close the view. Let's see what happens now when we do Control M. It brings up the third slide, which in this case is the blank slide. That should make things much faster because Control M is pretty fast and easy if you use the keyboard shortcuts. If you modify your Slide Master, you can make it so the default slide that's inserted with Control M is in fact the blank slide. My name is Susan Joy Schlieff, the PowerPoint Queen. For more quick tips, please go to my Facebook page, PowerPoint Queen Rules, or go to my YouTube channel, at Message Media Magic, and I have a special playlist there with PowerPoint Quick Tips.